Oop! There's a male scorpion. I need a male. I'm looking for obsidian. This is right underneath my base. I can't find any darn obsidian. It's all ore. Oh, darn it. Shucky darn. Hmm, I don't know if I want to tame that scorpion. I don't need a high level one for making eggs. Ah, screw it. Let's do it. Come on, bird. Let's do it. Oh, he's out. Go to sleep. Alright, come on. Aphrodite, we need to go get some some stuff. All right, folks, we got ourselves a scorpion. Sting, level 79 is what he tamed out at. Word up. Let's take him up, introduce him to his new girlfriend. Get a little cupid going on here. A little cupid action. Today is a sad, sad day. I jumped on the server a minute ago, well, about half an hour ago, and my RG, Raptor, and Carno are all gone. They are not in the kill. They didn't die. Let's see, tribe mate, no, no. That's that. That's, that's where we tamed the Gallimimus yesterday. There is no kill mail. And I can't find them. I have flown within four ledges all the way to the bottom. Doing circuits trying to find them. I, I don't know, folks. It's a sad, sad day. I don't know what's happened to them. What really sucks is my RG had all that stuff on him. All that narcotic that I've been crafting up. Nothing like starting over, I guess. Yeah, there are nowhere to be found. I have searched and whistled and searched some more. Because, let me show you this. There is only one way. Well, there should have only been one place where they could fall. It depends on which way they were attacked. I, I don't know. What a pain in the sphincter. So that gives us our objective for today, folks. We need to fix our base to where this doesn't happen. You know what's weird is I've got the homing pigeon mod. We have the homing pigeon and they they've all got bracelets. If you look here, oh wrong button. Look here, see that? That's the homing pigeon leg ring. And what it does is when you fall off your bird they will try to return to the flag. So what you do is you make a flag using obsidian, which is what I had to go find the other day, and you place your blue, see that blue flag? And they're supposed to fly back to it. Now, here's the deal. The Carno and the Raptor were both standing right here when I logged off. And they were on neutral so they could defend themselves. Now, if they got attacked, which they'd have to be attacked before they did anything, I'm thinking. And the RG was right there behind him. He was right here. He was on neutral as well. Oh, there's my RG right there. Oh, okay, Aphrodite's still here. So we lost our Carno and our Raptor. Let me fix the gamma for you guys. Sorry about that. So if they got attacked, we're looking. I'm thinking he went off this spot right here from where they were standing. And I'm not getting a kill mail. Where are they at? Well, anyways, what we're going to do today is go do a bunch of resource gathering. We are going to put walls all the way around our, our rim of our cliffs. So I quit losing dinosaurs down here. See, it's not like they could go up. Now, if they kept aggro and stuff... Bah! I don't know. It sucks. But what do you do? At least my RG's still alive, though. That's a plus. 
That's a plus. At least there is some light at the end of the tunnel. I mean, our carnal was okay. He wasn't high level, but you know what? Oh, well. So, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to start gathering tons and tons of resources so that I can build this wall. And let me show you a small technicality. I've, and I'll show you when I gather the resources. There's a, something wrong with the map here that I'm going to have to show you guys. So, yeah, I'm going to gather up, get all my resource munchers going here. You follow him and him. Oh, don't, don't be looking in his inventory. Why does he have rocks on him? Who has rocks on him? Is it you? Somebody has rocks. You, you rocks need to go away. All right, I'm going to go gather resources. Oh, yeah, I didn't show you this. Yesterday while I was goofing around, well, actually it was the middle of the night last night. I couldn't sleep, so I built me a taming pin. I was going to tame a carbonimus, or not a carb, a castoroid, a beaver, but I didn't get around to it because it was going to take like two and a half hours and it was already two o'clock in the morning, so I decided we'll wait. So what I did was I went and trained up a gallimimus because that is castoroid kibble, kibble for the castoroid. So I did that instead. So we have a gallimimus. Sorry, I got the hiccups. So over there we've got a galley mammoth in the pin with ah, with the other dinos. Right there. Uh, right there. Galley mammoth. Oh yeah. So that way we can make some kibble for the beavers so it doesn't take two darn hours. Come on. Train. Let's go. We got work to do. All right, we're going to go make a bunch of fence foundations, a bunch of walls, and a giant gate. Because we're going to need one more gate for what I got planned. Er, come on, come on. Oh, shit. That is ridiculous. <coughs> Tongs was killed by a stupid bear. What a rough day. What a very rough day again. I don't... <sighs> he fell off the cliff and landed on a bear and boom. Done. Game over. Alright, so now we got to disperse all this stuff between the other ones so that I can... Actually, we can just craft a bunch of junk. Oh, anyways, folks. Moving forward. Alright. We're back at base. <clears throat> that sucks. Lost a stupid castroid. He should have had him because it was bloody before it went off the cliff. Oh well, that's life. So let me show you guys something about building walls up here on this cliff so that if you ever decide you want to try this, you can think about it. So, right here, let's say you're trying to lay down some uh, foundations and you put it down and look, you can't see it. What the, what the heck, Bobby? Where'd it go? So, it was kind of a pain at first when I was doing this. Like, that's a railing right there. I put it down to see where I was at. But it was such, such a, such a... See, I got the foundation, and it disappears. Now I can't see it. So there's something with the map. I don't know. I'm not a computer guy. I'm not a game maker. I don't know nothing about this stuff. I just play the games. So, there's a trick to laying these down up here if you guys are building. What you do is you low crawl, and then you can see them, which is kind of weird, because now I can see it, the map. It's kind of goofy. So, that's how you get around this not being able to see your fence foundation. Maybe. It gets hard when it gets thin again, because you can't see underneath. But what I was doing is if I start back here, Come on, it was working. Get over this. Get over that. There we go. Okay, and then if we low crawl over to it, I can just barely get it before it disappears. Um, which way? I need to turn the fit. Turn it. That's right. So, there's that one, and then we'll, ah. 
there's one more out there. We need that one to go straight, please. It has a it has its issues, but it, this is how you can get it to work, sort of. It'll really drive you a little bit bonkers. Let's try it from this angle. Please go straight, please. Ah. Anyway, so that's how I was doing this, how I'm getting these walls to show up. Oop, there it was. Did you see it? I'm not going to make you guys suffer through this. I didn't even notice this, folks. They're right here. There's Roger. He was up underneath Carrie. There's Cletus right back there. They're here. Oh, hoo, hoo. we still have them. We still lost our casteroid, though, but oh well. So I've got walls all the way around. Except a gate down there, I need to do a gate. But now I think we can put Cletus on roaming, and he should be able to handle anything that spawns in. And what's weird is like that. Look at that. This is weird. Why? Just up there chilling. Why is that? What? Why are they spawning on trees? And I don't know if they're spawning above me and dropping in, or spawning down here. But I've had a few Carnos and stuff drop in on us. So I don't know what's going on there. But anyways, so I got the walls up. I'm going to go build a gate. Let's just do that on camera. Let's go over here yonder ways. Oh, I can do it right here. Craftables. Gate. I need the door, not the S1. I don't like the S1s. It's wood, thatch, and fiber. Wood, thatch, and fiber. The wood. The thatch. And there's fiber inside. Zephabe. Bow, bow. Gate. Craft it up, baby. Give me some of that gate action. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You remember that guy? Kool-Aid commercial? Oh yeah. Booyah. Cha-ching. Alrighty. Now what are we going to do? We need another beaver. So, let's go. I'm going to get prepped and set up for a beaver tame. Um, I don't know how much narcotics I've got here. Probably not enough. I need to do a run with the trike, do some narcotic growing. Plus, that'll give me another level. Oh, yeah, we better make some more before we go after a beaver. Plus, we are so close. Look at this. Look at that. 800. Well, 700 and some change, but shoot, yes. All right, trike. Let's go get some berries. Oh, I need to unload you. All right, I'll see you guys in a second. Oh, yeah, we are crafting like crazy, people. I got every one of these going. Look at that. We're climbing. 72, 920, 80 to go. Need some more flint. Need some more berries. <laughs> Racking them up now. Oh, I need more flint. We'll have to get more flint on the next trip. Oh, yeah. 133, 31. Just to crafting up, folks. Just crafting. Oops. Need more flint. Okay, fine. Fine. It's like, there it is. We got it. We got it. We got it. What did I, oh, what did I want to work on? Fortitude. And now we need electrical intersection. This one. Right? An electrical cable intersection. That's the one. I think we're good. Shoot, yes. Now we can do the, uh, the other thing. Get going with this. Let's see. Structures. Electrical intersection. Turn on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Sure, why not? Did I make some straights the other day? Did I make a generator? Generator! Doohickey! Let's make a few of these. Make ten of those, just for the heck of it. Oh, ladies and gentlemen! We can make the refrigerator, get that all set up, and then we can get serious about this game. Yeah, like I'm not serious already. But we need to do another beaver and all that good stuff. But what I'm trying to do is I'm hoping is we get some Gallimimus eggs so I can do a, a uh, tame for the 
the beavers. Don't see any egg there. No eggs. Oh, we got a dillo, dillo egg. They are really slow. And then I figured out with the um, stego, when she was up on the thing, it was disappearing. So when I broke the floor out, all of a sudden an egg showed up. So I got rid of the floors. We're gonna redo our little, our uh, oh, what do you call it? This thing. We're gonna redo the stables, make them a little bit more useful. All right. Let's go see how we're doing here. How are we doing here? Good job. Keep it up. Keep up the good work. Okay, let's take this and the generator and put the egg in the thing over here that I forgot about. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go set this up. We're getting sidetracked now. I've been waiting for so long for this level to show up that... So the fridges are going along that wall. And the generator is going to go in there. So let's do... Let's do this. Oh, I can't see it. Mm -hmm. That sucks. Hmm. Hmm. Wish I could see it better. Can I see it anywhere? Because then I can just make a grid square with them. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, folks. Give me a minute to figure this out. I'm going to make a few of these. Make a few mistakes. All that good stuff. So, see you in a second. I think that's the money right there. Looks pretty good. Let's, let's try it. I'm just going to run them all. Because it doesn't really matter if I got it or not. Why are you on top of the ground now? What kind of crap is that? Are you connected? So now we need to put this guy. It's green. Okay, we need to run a test. We need to get some fuel. And see if this is going to work. And my phone's ringing. Fuel. Oh, we might as well grab the fridges. The fridges. That. This. I think we're good. I think we should be good. Should be good. My base is kind of spread out, so i got to do a lot of running. Check out the, the buffet area I made. <laughs> Isn't that cool? I gotta do the auto torches still, but yes, it's, it's awesome. So I don't understand why those ones went under. We got power. Ah, yep, yellow, yellow. Sweet. Now let's put down a power box. Hmm, can I put it there? I think so. Let's put the fridges. Oh, that's going to look dumb with that power box right there. I think it's going to work. I think it worked. We have power in the fridge. Oh my goodness, people. Woohoo, we did it. No, you're supposed to cheer, buddy. Cheer. Cheer. Yes! It can be done! This ain't working. Yes! <laughs> that looked right. <laughs> I'm such a dork. <laughs> Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we have left the Dark Ages. Oh, yes! Yes! Now, let's get this all set up right like I want it with the cooking area because we need f a bunch of fuel we need this oil we need to make a bunch of fuel so I don't have to sit here and refuel it all the time but, yeah we'll leave some of that in there so we got that got some fuel we need to leave some fuel in this one because that now we need some hide hide grab a bunch of hide and we'll go over here to this one take this junk out put this junk in Come on, baby, light my fire. Oh, yeah. 
Good, good, good. I love this sport. Alrighty. So now what we're going to do, ladies and gentlemen, is I'm going to goof around here. I'm going to play with my new kitchen. i got to add some more things to it, get it kind of spruced up a bit, and get it functioning. Um, I need to put... I'm going to wait to put these right here. Cooking pots. I was going to do them inside, but we're going to wait. I'm going to put some... Uh, what are the industrial cookers? Not the grill, but the cookers. That's what I'm thinking I want to do with that. So now you put doors on there. Just stuff to do. Lots and lots of stuff. Alright, we've got a fridge. Let's move some eggs around. I'll see you guys in a little bit. We have a target of opportunity running around. I need a male to go with my other Gallimimus. See if that helps with the baby taming. Get him stuck in a corner somewhere. Go to sleep, buddy. Oh, missed. Okay, go in the house. Go in the house there, buddy. You don't need to go that way. Ooh, he's bleeding. Uh-oh. Rut row. Better switch these out. I don't want to kill him. Go to sleep there, partner. He's gonna die. Yep. Oh well, it was for grins. I thought maybe I could get it, but no. All right, I'm still moving stuff around. All righty, folks. Welcome back. So I was goofing around, doing a lot of uh, crafting and some crafting. What else do I got here? I've been making gunpowder because what I did was I made a long neck rifle. Check it out. 100% damage. 186.2. I think this is better, but this will be good for tranking stuff so I don't kill it with that thing. And I was making shotgun shells. But I'm running low on... I need more gunpowder. We need more gunpowder. So, what I'm going to do, folks, is I need to go get some oil. Some gun... Or not gunpowder. I need to go get some more stuff to make gunpowder. And I might even tame up a beaver, I think. But, we'll see where I end up. I'm going to just go and do a bunch of resource gathering right now. I'm going to get my birds out. We're going to fly for some oil. And we'll see where we end up. But for me and you today, that will be all, folks. Thanks for joining me. We got a lot accomplished today. Got walls around the base. Got my kitchen set up. Oh, yeah. Wife would be proud of me. Found my dinosaurs. All is well, except we lost the beaver, but... Boo hoo, oh well. Okay, y'all have yourselves a great day. If you made it this far, hit that thumbs up button. And don't forget to subscribe. You all have yourselves a wonderful, wonderful afternoon. We will catch you later.